light in the background. You'd think by now I'd have figured this out. All right, one more. All right. How are y'all doing today? A little different show for you here. Uh, I did a bonus broadcast last night, and I may still play something later today, but I came home from work on lunch and found this, my new WWE Slam Crate. I'll hold it in front of my face, even though I despise doing that. And we're going to see what's in it this month together. If you don't know, Slam Crate is by the Loot Crate people. I'm not being paid to advertise this. Uh, I'm a subscriber, have been since the first opportunity I had to, to be a subscriber. And I, I'm going to have an honest reaction to everything you see as we open it. So, all right. It says here, when I open it, Steve Austin's time has come. And when I get the shot, you are looking at the next WWE champion, which he didn't say WWE. And that's the bottom line, because Stone Cold said so. So, this month might be a Stone Cold Steve Austin theme. Let's take a look. The t-shirt is always the big draw. And I think this is probably Finn Balor. Oh, yeah. This is definitely Finn Balor. You got to see the back before I did. There's that. And in the front, that's pretty nice. That is the Demon King, Finn Balor. So that's a good shirt. Uh, good quality. Uh, this is the third. Hold on. This is the fourth one of these. And I'm counting the pins on my shelf. This is the fourth one of these. And the AJ Styles shirt was really flimsy, and I didn't like it. But uh, Luke Crick, to their credit, has a feedback on every one of these. And so, I'm glad they listened because they haven't had a week one since then. Oh my gosh, cat, really? So you're not paying attention to my cat right now, huh, folks? What is this? All right. So the next thing, with the Stone Cold Steve Austin theme, this is some kind of Stone Cold Steve Austin figure. Cat, get down from there. Muse. Down. You're going to wreck something, and I'm going to have to yell at you on, on the internet. And that doesn't going to make Daddy feel good. It's some kind of Steve Austin thing here. I don't know. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Okay, hold on. i got to get a cat. Stupid. Come on. Down. Stay down. Sorry about that, folks. That's Muse making another guest appearance here on Ion Games. Right. Well, I think it's a figure. I'm not going to open it until I have to, but there you can see a little image. It looks like Steve Austin on the ropes. Let me pull it up a little bit so it's past the logo. So, back that way. There we go. I have to wait for the thing to respond to me. So that's first. Do I want to open it? Gosh, I'm not sure. We're going to take a chance, not at the high school dance either. Let's see. Oh, yeah. Yep, it's a Steve Austin figure. you got to make the base. All right, so I'll show you the figure. There you go. That's not shabby. So there's Stone Cold. Kind of cool. And you can make a ring base. The other one is Triple H, so I don't know if in another month we'll get Triple H or if that's one you just have to buy from the Loot Crate store. Um, neat. Nothing super overwhelming, but cool. Cool to say the least. And I'm not going to get it back in the box, so we'll work on that when we're not broadcasting. If you just tuning in, I'm Dustin. This is Ion Talks Games, not Ion Games today. I played a little bit last night, so I wanted to... Do a little something different this morning, or now afternoon here. All right, now we're getting somewhere. This month's theme is Masters of the Mic. Now we got a theme. <laughs> All right. Well, there's an interesting pin. We finally got the uh, Universal Championship. Look at that. Every month we're getting a title pin. So there's the Universal title. I actually thought it was the women's uh, for a few minutes, so I wouldn't have been upset about But there's the Universal title. I've got a book here, Masters of the Mic. 
It's got a lot of really good talkers on it. And, oh, wow. This looks like it's some uh, entries out of the WWE Encyclopedia. Austin, Rock, Cena, Jericho, the Nature Boy, Ric Flair, who I had the pleasure of meeting last week, Rowdy Roddy Piper, The Miz, one of these people doesn't belong, Stephanie McMahon, <laughs> Dutty Road, <clears throat> Dutty Road, The Mac and Dream, baby, The Mac and Dream. Stephanie, The Miz, and Kevin Owens. Uh, two of those people don't belong. We'll just throw that out there. You can decide who. And then, uh, of course, with Loot Crate, you get a little booklet telling you everything that you're getting. Best part about this one is it also usually doubles as a poster. Oh, here's cool. Outside the ring with Alexa Bliss. So you get a bonus interview of Alexa Bliss. Anything involving uh, Little Miss Bliss is not a bad thing. And the poster this month is The Rock, which makes sense with Masters of the Morning. I'd rather have the, the road, baby. All right, the other thing we got, last but not least, and I kind of saved it for least because I'm not sure if it's going to be cool or not. This is a WWE microphone cup set. So I don't know if it's both cups that are being shown or just one. Let's find out together. I kind of hope it's cups, not glasses. Oh, it's glass. And it's both. Okay. I don't hate that. Let's see if I can not break them live on the internet. Huh, folks? And no, I'm not seeing the chat. I do apologize. I didn't set up to see the chat today. I'm um, just kind of getting this thing knocked out. Because I promised you guys Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. So here's cup one. Standard WWE microphone. It's plastic, but not glass, but it's still wrapped in bubble wrap, which I appreciate, because even though my kids are teenagers now, really. And here's the one I really could care less about, but I don't hate on it. Uh, I'm not a hater. Enzo and Cass' is Mike. Um, interesting. I mean, cool. Different stuff you get. The service is like $40, $45, $44. I don't remember. It just comes out, and I pay it. Um, <laughs> so, all right. All in all, it's a decent month. Not great. Uh, the Steve Austin figure is cool. I'm actually going to leave it in the box and put it with my other ones up there. Um, I'm all right with it, though. And then we've got... Oh, get in there. Let's see if I can get this put away correctly. It's going to be the real challenge here. See, so, yeah, i got the Steve Austin figure here in my hands. We'll go ahead and put it away. So that I can, yep, there he goes now. All right, Austin is here, and much like the rebel he always was on TV, he doesn't want to go back in his box, and he doesn't want to listen to authority. So you got the Steve Austin collectible. It may end up just earning its way out of a box, although I really don't want to. We'll find out. We've got the Universal Championship pin. There it is in front of my face. We got a cool little book called Masters of the Mic, and I'll just move it around a little bit so you can see it. Uh, profiles and stories about different good talkers. A poster of The Rock that's in here along with an Alexa Bliss interview. We've got the two microphone cups, Debbie microphone and Enzo and Cass microphone. And then, last and certainly not least, the main event of the show, of course, is the ex Loot Crate exclusive Finn Balor Demon King t-shirt. And yes, I'm a big boy, so it's a big shirt right here for you. So there is the second ever episode of Ion Talks Games. And I know you're sitting there saying, uh, Dustin, you didn't talk about games, you talked about wrestling. Well, the only other Ion Games was a discussion of our wrestling series. And I talked about wrestling. And I have streamed a lot of wrestling on this channel. Uh, no, uh, all games, and I'm getting ready to stream my first import, I, I just gotta learn how to play it a little better, because I'm tired of looking stupid, and then, oh, other way, there we go, that big, shiny glare, block it with my fat head, see, look at that, um, and so I'm looking to play Natsume Championship Wrestling, once I figure out how to play it, and then Super Fire Pro Wrestling 2, which is my first import game I've ever bought, looking forward to that, 
I think I'll give the book to uh, my buddy Joel uh, for his kids, because I think they'd get a kick out of reading about it. And I might even give him the rock poster, too, because I don't have any interest in the rock, and I don't really hang too many posters up. No, I don't hate on the rock. Of course, I'm just not a not a massive fan. I've always been a Shawn Michaels guy. I've always been a uh, more of a workers fan uh, than anything, really. All right, so ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for watching. And I'm going to try to play a game or something later. Maybe stream a little Hearthstone. Go this way. Go this way. Come on, fat boy. This way. There you go. So I'm going to try to stream a little Hearthstone, I think, later. I'm not sure. Um... You know, just going to play it by ear today if I do another show or not. I already gave you a bonus show last night. Playing Static on PSVR. Really interesting game. Take a look at it, uh, at that video if you would. Let me know what you think. Like, subscribe, and share. You can see everything I've ever done over on YouTube at bit.ly slash clambakeproductions. And, of course, every Tuesday and Thursday, Tuesday, Thursday and Saturday, whew, here live on twitch.tv slash ion for life I'm Ion. I've been talking about wrestling, unboxing the new WWE Slam Crate that I just got in the mail today. I hope you enjoyed it. If you want to see more videos where we talk about different stuff, let me know. I'm always interested. This has been a Clambake Productions podcast. Thanks for listening.